Hello guys, welcome to another video. My name is Jake. This is Jake B Tech. Today I'm going over the October 4th event, which is in fact happening tomorrow. So let's get into the video. Visit the phone workshop Cranley for great deals on phone repair, unlocking and accessories. Link in video description. <laughs> on October 4th of 2016, Google are releasing two new phones. This year they are not going to be Nexus phones, this year they are going to be Pixel phones. This year we are going to be seeing a whole new launcher with the new devices. The Nexus devices it used to run stock Google Now launcher, but now are having a total redesign. I think this is because Google wanted to just start fresh and they wanted more control over the launcher. The launcher has been going over the web for a while as you can see in a previous video which I have made which will be linked up there. As I said earlier Google will be releasing two new phones the Pixel X and the Pixel XL. The Pixel X will have a 5 inch 1080p display whereas the Pixel XL will have a 5.5 inch 1440p display. The Pixel X specs include 4GB of RAM, a 2770mAh battery, a 12MP rear facing camera and an 8MP front facing camera. Wow and I've also just found out that Google will be putting headphone jacks on their new devices. Apple if you're listening you could learn a thing or two from Google. All you Apple geeks there get commenting your hate comments down below. Both phones will also have fingerprint scanners on the back which I think is a great place to have the fingerprint scanners. The processor for this phone will most likely be the Snapdragon 820. As of yet we are not sure what type of waterproofing the phone will have or if it will have it at all. This phone is almost certainly going to be built by HTC so there will most likely be some fast charging and also some wireless charging involved. Getting onto the Pixel XL, this device's specs nearly also match the specs of the Pixel X except having a 5.5 inch 1440p display as I've already said. Also Google could learn a thing or two here about putting higher quality displays into their devices when charging ridiculous amounts of money. Also, the device's battery will most likely be a bit bigger at 3450 mAh. If you enjoyed this video, please give the video a thumbs up. If you dislike the video, dislike the video and tell me down below why in the comment section. My name is Jake, this has been JP Tech, I'll see you in my next video.